Hello and welcome to PA Academy. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to inscribe a circle inside an octagon. So an octagon is a polygon with eight, eight sides. As you can see, this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. eight. And by the way, if you want to, if you are interested in knowing how to you know, draw or construct an octagon, you'll find the link in the description of this video. But what you are looking at now is how, to, how do we inscribe a circle inside this octagon such that this circle will touch the eight sides all the eight sides of this circle now the principle we are going to be using for this video applies to every other polygon either it is pentagon hexagon heptagon nonagon decagon you know it's the same principle and what is that principle just bisect any two angles any of the two angles you can see we have uh, one two three four five six seven eight we have eight angles inside this uh, octagon so just bisect any two of them you want to get the center I mean, when you bisect it, where they meet to represent the center of the circle. So let's do that. So for this video, I'm going to be using um, angle A and angle C. So these are the two angles we are going to be bisecting to get the center. So let's do that. To do that, so just pick your, your compass at any convenient uh, length. Just, I prefer it to small like this. So from point C now, so you place your compass on point C. So you draw this. So once you draw, you draw this arc. So then you can increase your the length of the compass. So from this point on that on this line BC, that is where this arc that we've just drawn. So from this point, you draw an arc. With the same length, you come to this other point again. You draw another another arc. So where the boats meet, so where these two arc meet, you draw a lines from point C. So you draw a lines straight through to point C. So with that, we've just bisect this angle C. So what we've just done to angle C, you are let's apply the same thing to A. Don't forget, I said you are just going to bisect any two angles. So I decided to use angle A and angle C. So you can just use angle E, angle G, angle H, and angle G, you know, like that. So the same thing, I just pick a small length on my compass. Oops. So with that, I can increase the length a bit. So it must just use something convenient for you. So from where this arc that we just drawn is cutting line A, B, from there again, we draw an arc. So with the same length, you come to this second one. So where the two arcs meet, you draw it straight down to point A. Draw it down to now. You can see that these two lines they are meeting at this point. They are meeting at this point. So that represents the center of the circle that we are going to inscribe inside this octagon. So what the next thing we are just going to do is, from that point, you can draw a straight line to any to the center of any of the uh, of the side. Any of the side. So let's call this center point O, and let's call this this point point Z, point Z. So now let's measure. Let's measure the length. So the, the length of it is equal, that's also the radius of the circle that we are going to be inscribing inside. So this is giving us um, 6 centimeter, that's 16 millimeter. So you can pick our compass and let's measure 6 centimeter. That is also 60 millimeter. Okay. So now we can draw the circle.
So I'm just going through so that it can be bold a bit. So you can see we already have a circle touching all the eight sides. So let me just go through it one more time so that it can be bold. Okay, the circle is clearer now. So this is it, guys. So just follow the same principle. Pick any two angles. You bisect it. You get your center. And that will represent the radius. So you just, from the center, you draw a straight line to any, to the center of any of the side. You measure it. That will give you the length of the radius. And then you are good to draw your circle. So that is it for this video. If you find this video helpful, kindly click on the like button. If you are yet to subscribe to PA Academy, please click on the subscribe button uh, to help this channel grow. Click on the subscribe button and the little bell icon beside the subscribe button. And then I will see you all in another video. Thank you.